tell me how this all started? Uh... Yes, it started because there was a brand called Gamarelli that was only available in Rome and it was a uh, yeah, a few years ago, also internet had already started to get these socks. These uh, that uh, come from a very famous tailor uh, in Rome that uh, provide socks for uh, cardinals, bishops, and the, and the pope. You needed to send a fax uh, to make a bank transfer. Uh, to they did not speak very well English, so it was complicated to uh, uh, to have a sizing conversion and know to know exactly what you wanted mm -hmm. and. Um, since these socks were uh, had a, a nice history, we thought that it was a nice idea uh, to use internet and some modern tools uh, to make these socks uh, available worldwide. Yeah. And so we've started with just uh, three colors, red, purple and black. Yeah. And then we, after a few uh, months, we've extended the array because uh, customers wanted more, uh, uh, more socks and uh, more uh, material. Uh, more uh, colors, more pattern, and uh, in the end we came to have this uh, very li large array of socks. Because I see lots of socks in here and lots of colors, a very nice one as well. Yeah, and, and was that first the online shop or uh, and afterwards? Yeah. The, yeah, first the online shop uh, and then uh, we thought that it was uh, uh, nice to have a shop mm -hmm. because um, online people are always uh, uh, curious to know Who's behind? Uh, and uh, I, uh, people are also eager to to be uh, reassured and be mm -hmm. sure that there is a uh, it's not a, a, fan, a phantom uh, that yeah. they go that we, they will not be able to uh, to to call if they have a problem. And mm -hmm. the idea of a shop is, I think, uh, even in the 21st century, a good thing for uh, customers online. Yeah. Can you tell me something about how you create create that great customer experience of Mar Chaussette Rouge? Yes. Um, our idea was to, uh, I mean, I personally like uh, the experience that you get when you go in a in shop uh, where you are uh, a patron, so a regular customer, mm -hmm. and this idea that uh, people recognize you, uh, this idea that uh, when you enter a restaurant, people know that uh, you like the quiet table uh, at the back and uh, such things. Uh, it was something that we wanted to recreate online, um, and the this is why we were like the idea of handwritten notes when we send parcels, uh, we know the numbers, uh, the number of orders uh, customers have made, we know uh, their habits and their taste, and so it's a, a nice way for us to show our customers that uh, although it's online, we keep, uh, we, we keep them in mind and uh, when they come back it's nice to, to see them again, so mm -hmm. it was uh, this idea of uh, uh, maintaining uh, this, uh, having this a customer experience that you usually get in a physical mm -hmm. shop but online yeah and so in here in this corner it all happens i see the, all, the, all the wrapping paper as well yeah, yeah the, i mean it's not only here that it happens because we also have a, a wrapping uh, area there but mm -hmm. uh, we, we it's we all indeed uh, uh, wrap socks here and then uh, the post collects them and we ship them worldwide yeah okay great story thanks for telling us thank okay. you for